From Robertson Field at Seitao Stadium in New York City, this is the Ivy League on ESPN. And today we've got a huge matchup in the middle of the Ivy League baseball season between the Harvard Crimson, who come in with a 5-3 and three Ivy League record third place, and the Columbia Lions, who are in first place right now in the Ivy League with a 7-2 and two conference record. Lions 15-13 overall. Harvard 13 and 13. This is the long awaited rematch of the 2019 Ivy League playoff series. These two teams finally face off again three years later. Big time curveball when it's on. There was a good one on three and one. On three and two, he goes to the fastball, and Blake was ready. He hits it deep to center field. Williams going back. It's gone. Two batters in, two nothing Columbia as Andy Blake strikes for his team leading seventh home run of the season. 3-2, shot inside out swing into shallow left field. Snowpet coming on, he's gonna have to play it on the hop and it bounds away from him. And rounding third is Eberle. And the throw will not be in time to the plate on the relay. Hayden shot pulls into second. He's got an RBI hit. The first five Columbia batters have reached. I believe they've hit for the cycle if that's ruled for a double within the first five batters. It's already 4-0 Columbia. And he nails his fastball deep in a right center field. Back at the wall, it's gone! Solomon with his third home run in the last couple weekends. Columbia's second home run of the first inning. They've put up a seven spot in the opening frame against Harvard. Seven to nothing. Bill Decker said that he didn't think Missouri was gonna be such a factor like he is and he continues to deliver by lining one into center field for Harvard's first run of the day. And he attacks this fastball and lines it deep in a left center field. This one's off the base of the fence. Blake is going to get the wave at third. And there will be another RBI for McGregor. As Blake slides in safely on McGregor's RBI double. He has a triple and a double in the first two innings of this game. 3-1 and this ball smoked in a right field for a base hit. Eberle scores. Shot gets the hold at third base. Columbia goes station to station. E.J. Kreutzman now has 15 runs driven in in 17 home at-bats and 15 runs driven in in 21 Ivy League at-bats. 3-2, runners are off, and this ball's lined in a left field for a base hit. Cooper rounds third. He scores. Berger to third base. It's an RBI single for Logan Bravo. He's now reached base in 16 straight games. And Harvard looking to start a rally here as they continue to chip away in the third. Oh, two, and this ball's lined up the middle into center field by the diving Mowry. Nearly took May's head off, and then Solomon overran it. It goes all the way to the fence. Two Harvard runs are going to score easily. And Snowpack will end up at third base. Will Jacobson? Lines this pitch deep to left field. Back goes Hage out of the track. He looks up. It's gone. Will Jacobson with a two-run blast to left. His second home run of the season. And all of a sudden, Harvard has scored five times here in the third inning. And they're within 12-6. to six. And this ball is lifted deep into center field. Williams going back. He's at the wall. He's looking up. It is gone. Cole Hage lifts off to center. His fourth home run of the season. And Columbia's third home run in the first three innings today. 13 to 6 Lions. In the second. He swings at the first pitch here and launches it deep into center field. Spencer Williams has a long way to run and he'll watch it go over the fence. Nonetheless, Hayden shot with Columbia's second home run of the inning, fourth of the game. Shot is homered in back to back games. And for the sixth time this season, 
And the Lions have put up three runs here in the third to respond to Harvard's top half. It is 15 to six. May deals, Brown lines it up the middle and the center field. Snowbeck, who is awful, score easily. As Solomon gets it in, it's an RBI single for Zach Brown. And Harvard has cut it to 15 to seven. One, two, and this ball's lined in the right field. That'll drop in, and Harvard will cash in another two-out RBI hit. This time, Jacobson scores on Peter Levin's RBI single. So that's three straight two-out hits for Harvard. Bravo leads the team with 11 doubles, and the 0-1 is launched in a deep center field. Back goes Solomon, just a courtesy glance. That one's over the scoreboard. What a shot for Logan Bravo, his second home run of the season. And all of a sudden, Harvard is within 15 to 10 here in the fifth. 1-0. Oh, getting the gap. That's yep. indeed where it goes off the bat of Tyler McGregor. Hagen to score. Blake gets the wave. The relay throw coming from George Cooper just a little bit late. It's a two-run double for Tyler McGregor as he goes to third on the play. And the Lions have opened up a 19-10 lead with this two-out rally. The minor leaguers like they should have been the whole time. As Shot swings at the first pitch and flings it way back in a left center field. Unbelievable. High up off the fence. Let's go. As he stuttered around first and will hold there. Oh my God. Nonetheless, scoring on the play is Weston Eberle. It's a long RBI single for Aiden Schott, and it's 21 to 10. And this one is ripped, got a fastball, and Maservi launched it deep into center field, and that one is gone. Peter Maservi with a two-run blast to center, his second home run of the season. Harvard's third home run of the game. And the Crimson are within nine. In the ninth, it should be a sun aided double in my mind. Grounded to second base, Mowry's got it, and this one is over. Columbia's won nine games in a row. They're nine and zero in the month of April. Eight straight wins, featuring ten or more runs, as Columbia once again breaks out the offensive fireworks, and they stay in first place with a 21 to 12 victory over the Harvard Crimson in game one.